Good afternoon, Kent High School. I'm Brandon Bowling, and this is Lexi Phillips. Welcome back. We hope that you all had a great Thanksgiving. There will be a very exciting episode, and we welcome our new member to KNN, Mason Bloom. Also looking forward to some musical highlights, a new segment with Doug, and another edition of Curtis vs. Kaiser. Welcome back to the Sports Corner, and today is a special day because it marks the return of William Mason Bloom. Oh yeah. Mason, do you have some words for the fans? Mm -hmm. I guess just good to be back. Heck yeah. Good to hear. Scores? Yep, we got some scores for you guys. So, girls swim, defeated Elida. Uh, boys swim, had a tough fought, loss to Elida. And then, girls basketball defeated LCC. It's good to hear. Is that all the scores from this weekend? Yep. There's more to come. Mason, you want to give us the rundown of the swimming? Uh, You're an inside source. I don't know. I guess we just gave maximum effort. The boys got heat barely, but Ooh. just couldn't come out with the W, I guess. Hello, and welcome to another installment of College Football Picking. And today, we have Curtis as our guest again. Oh, yeah. He was undefeated last time. Yeah, 3-0. And we've got five games this week, and to see if Curtis can keep it up. The first game, Stanford versus USC. William, who you got? I got USC. Wow. Chase. You know we're going to go Stanford. I want to go with Mason, go USC. I'm joining Chase on the Stanford train. Next, we're going to go to the ACC Championship with Miami and Clemson. Willis? Oh, I'm going to go with Clemson. Go with Miami. I'm gonna go with Miami. I gotta go Clemson. And now we're heading to the SEC championship game. Mason, what are your thoughts? Uh, I'm gonna go with Auburn. Auburn. For those who don't know, it's Georgia playing Auburn. Chase, what are your thoughts? Go with Auburn as well. Curtis, what are your thoughts? I'm gonna go with Auburn. Why is that? They're gonna burn them down, you know <laughs> what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna go with Georgia. And now to the Big 12 championship game, TCU and Oklahoma. We'll start with Curtis this time. Oh. Go with uh, Oklahoma. Chase. Go with TCU. Ooh. Mason. I'm going to go with Oklahoma. I'll have to join the Oklahoma gang. I haven't watched a football <laughs> game since middle school. Oh. KNN would like to congratulate Alex Holsolder for winning the Daughters of American Revolution Good Citizen Scholarship in the Lima chapter. She's the first person from Kenton to win the award in over 30 years. Now let's take a look at the musical highlights from Kenton High School's special preview two weeks ago. Next the beauty, look at her. She'll be the most sought after girl with the ball. She doesn't want to go. Meg, what will I do if someone asks me to dance? Just smile and say, I did Dreadful little monster. 
Costco's are you? I'm Judge Bobet. Ah, yes. Lori <laughs> says you want to play my priceless piano. It's out of the question. It belonged to my daughter, Lori's mother. It's been locked since you passed away, and that tells us stay. Are you afraid of me? A little. Why? It may have something to do with your face, sir. <laughs> <laughs> of the CATS International Club, the annual trip to Kenton Elementary School to read books about different cultures and help students with cultural crafts is scheduled for December 15th. Sign up in Mrs. Geise's room for help. Now it's time for some of our special segments, Good Vibes with Trey, but this week preview a new piece, Doug Explains the Universe. Here for another episode of Curtis vs. Kaiser, and this is for the World Championship of Saber Fighting. Three, two, one. Fight! Ah. Oh. Oh. Ah. No. Oh. Oh. oh my god! Hello, I'm Doug, and this is Doug Explains the Universe. Today I'm here to talk about black holes and what they do to you. If the Earth were to float into a black hole right now, some pretty crazy things would happen. First, you just wouldn't know, and then all of a sudden, everything gets spaghettified. You start stretching out into long strands of spaghetti floating toward the black hole. And you wouldn't even see it because all the light around you is getting sucked up by it faster than you can see. And before you know it, you're gone. Well, that's all for the black holes. I might see you again some other time if I go if I don't get sucked up. In Good vibes, with Trey Jeffries. My quote of the week is: Every great dream begins with a dreamer. Always remember you have within you the strength and the patience and the passion to reach for the stars. The National Honor Society Toy Drive is coming up December 6th through the 13th. The toys will be donated to a local organization to help give kids who may not get a present a gift for Christmas. Drop off your toys in Mrs. Harshfield's room. Thank you for joining us for this week's episode of KN. Winter sports are now in full swing, so be sure to come out and support the Wildcat team. As always, reach out to us on Twitter at KentonKNN with ideas and be sure to check out the poll. Have a great day, Kenton High School.